you know, I've been thinking, and, um, why am I the only person in the world who doesn't like this game? Maybe I was destined to not like this game, or maybe I'm the only human left on Earth and everyone else's robots programmed to like this game. Th then again, they probably would have never played this game to start with if they were robots, but... Why? Then again... Why is this entire scene being done in letter format? I don't think anyone even does this anymore. Why is this so outdated? Why is this not being done anymore? Hmm. It'd be really cool if it send letters just like an MLP with with the little dragon who just burns all my letters and it teleports straight to the princess. If I had a princess, that that would be the, that'd be the first main the main fact here. And then then again, this game. Why am I doing these little contemplations? before each episode of this game. I wonder what contemplation means, and if I properly use that in a sentence. Hmm, probably doesn't mean anything. Probably doesn't mean anything. Hello, everybody! Welcome back to Let's Play Kirby's Epic Yarn. <sighs> I really, I really hate this game with a passion. I really do. Like, I thought it was kind of cool at first, but just, oh, Nintendo, you just... What did you do to yourselves? As you guys can tell, this is getting kind of obvious what you do. It isn't even worth watching an LP for, for like help or anything. Like honestly, anyone watching this for help, I really want to know what what the hell's what the hell's wrong with you? Because honestly, this is the freaking easiest game I own. Come on, freaking freaking baby games are harder than this. No offense, Nintendo, but seriously. Oh, that's good. I'm gonna go for the bottom again now. How do you get down through? Oh, no. I also like the little formations with the beats. It's kind of cool, but... Don't need you here. I also this little attack you can do is this. And that's, a lot of, that's actually a much more entertaining attack, but... Oh... Uh. This game just pisses me off so much. It just didn't go up to my expectations and uh... Getting pissed. Getting pissed. Is there a way down there? Cause I swear there was. Aw, oh, ain't that cute. Nintendo, you think you're so shitty. That's adorable. Now this is a little thing I did like about the game, though, is this. And the fact that not only is it playing the old music, the freaking transformation part is the best thing in the game. It's a little bit easy. But everything's easy in this game. Also, you lose a lot of money if you get hurt in this part, so... we prefer if you didn't. It's also very hard to aim this thing. Because the aiming is... Pretty... Oh yeah, you guys are the ones you want to shoot. Uh, but the nice thing is you can jump, float,
Okay, now this little wheel thing here. I don't know how you describe it. I'm not an expert on whatever the fuck this game is. But it changes your back, so it's not really anything good you want to get hooked up with, but... Well, actually, this is a good thing you like, caught with one of the things, but still. That's how you finish a level. Oh yeah, I forgot to get those. I forgot you get those things. I get this stuff and this stuff and this stuff. And control money, which is funny because the the cash in this game actually isn't based off of uh, um, how many things you find in the level. I don't think. Doesn't matter where you are. You press one, you'll throw it instantly. So I really don't see a point behind throwing it. Also, these levels are horribly designed, just saying. For for a game that's supposed to appeal to both genders. Ugh. Good job, Nintendo. You guys. Ugh. Unemployment agencies, I tell ya, they're busy lately. Honestly, I think one person in Nintendo Studios thought this was a good idea. And then everyone was like, fuck, this would be a horrible idea. And this one dude makes it. And he did a good job for what it is. Honestly, for what this game is, he did a good job at it. But let's be honest, we don't like what it is. Fuck it. Fuck it. This is very hard to do, by the way. Also, this is where the music actually just picking up. That's the one thing about this game is the music is great. If I haven't mentioned that yet, but that's the only thing about this game. But since you can't actually go up this one, also you don't get anything for that one. Oh my God, Nash! What was the point of this? No! There we are. See, see, you can even skip parts of the game. Someone else. Also, that's the guy from that little cutscene scene in the game. Isn't that beautiful. Go, 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 go. Why am I playing this game? Uh, you know when I start saying why am I playing this game, I don't really enjoy the fact that I'm playing this game. What the hell am I? Oh, that's right. I forgot about that. I forgot about a lot of things in this game, but that's besides the point. Flower clock. Don't really need it. Now I need the flower clock. That's what to get cool. Oh, it turns into a little tank. Well, I was supposed to do that. Is this like the disturbing part where it starts raining? Hey, little froggy umbrella stand ain't that cute. But it's wrong. So wrong. Get 
get out of there. Get out of there. Honestly, this is like the worst case scenario. He's like protected. That's not good. There's the only promoting safe sex. That's good. Ish. I don't know if Wildy would really influence anyone that much. I mean, honestly, that thing has never gotten anything in his life. Now, this little thing is an exclamation point. If you don't know what an exclamation point does, that's good because you never played this game before. Damn it! Basically, you can pull background stuff with these. And you get this junk thingy. And that's the things I'm hiding at. And, uh. You also got a gold thing, that's good. Uh, this LP is not gonna be half as funny as my first one. Just enjoy the pretty music. And the fact that it probably won't be a montage. Yeah, no one loves you. Or this game in general, but... Well, actually, apparently everyone loves this game in general, but... Why? I don't understand why people like this game so much. I just can't figure it out. It, I really, I can't see where some, some someone played this game and was like, Oh, this is a great game. Like, like a great game I can't understand. Maybe a okay game? Or a decent game? I can see where someone would like this game, but... Like a perfect game? No, I don't see where they get it at. Oh yeah, I forgot about this. Basically, the ability to suck things up, which is uh, totally a new thing. We all know that. And when you press one, you get like a weird electric orgasm or something. I don't know. And, uh, things get crazy. And then, uh, you can also use this little sucky thing to get the monies, but I don't really see anything. Watch out for the Gordos. That's what happens when you get caught up with the Gordo. And you see, look, I just recovered it all so easily. It's just... Oh, Nintendo, what did you guys do? I understand what Nintendo was trying, but why? Why are there bees here? I think it's the green ones are uh, temporary enemies, and the yellow ones are permanent enemies. I'm just gonna get myself another charge. Real quick here. Thank goodness, I didn't like that one at all. Oh, I think I got everything. Yeah, good. And there's really nothing else in this game that you should be worried about. So, that's good. And we get the little score thing where we get the score. And because I did good, I got a good score. So, I get a bunch of points and stuff. That happened. He also got the alarm clock. That's good. I really hate this game. <laughs> what the hell do you want? Don't care. Wait! Don't! You! Oh yeah, I forgot about this. Yeah, I'll show you what it looks like, and you can do this yourself. And basically, this is the only time you really need furniture. Hey. So I'm just gonna do this real quick right now. This song sounds familiar. Someone's gonna tell me where it's from, and I'm gonna be like, cry. Because I didn't recognize it. Someone moves in, 
And that is, if I remember correctly, that character's name is Zeke. And he plays a game called Hide and Seek. Oh, called, it is Hide and Seek. And, uh, got the joke, his name is Zeke and he plays Hide and Seek. Sorry, that was my angry, pissed off pig snort or whatever. I don't fucking know what that is. But seriously, this fucking game, people. Let's just do this. Get this angry badger waking up. No, I'm serious, though. It's a fucking angry badger. Fucking badger makes mountains with his hands, people. What do you expect? That's what badgers are for. Give or take a few mountains. And in the next episode, we will go to Rainbow Falls. Kirby, what has happened to you? What has freaking happened?